Well, when Radiohead uploads a new old song, it's time to come back from vacation. Kinda sounds like the beginning of Kid A. Oh, it's been such a long time. Can't believe they left this out of the record. Well, out of Abnishak, it sounds like it belongs in Abnishak. Those low jazzy influences. Oh god, that sound with headphones it must be like a drug. textures here. I'm not listening to Radiohead as much as I used to nowadays, but... Oh my god. I might as well will be from now on. I'm loving the drumming. Than anything. Oh, it's so natural, it's so, I don't know, it adds a lot to that atmosphere. I don't remember the last time strike me like this with his vocals It's the tone of the instruments. Radiohead has always had... Oh god! They have always had this very particular sound of theirs. And it's mainly because of that tone. No, seriously, I can't believe they left this out of Amnesia. <laughs> it's so curious how they named this anniversary record, Kirei Nishak. reacting to Radiohead on the channel. How come? Oh my god, that was a delight. Imagine discovering a brand new old song from one of your favorite bands. It's like when I listen to Full Moon by Death Grips without knowing that was from their ex-military period, but this one, this one has everything I miss from Radiohead since they released Hail to the Thief. And that's the reason why the Kira sessions are such a myth. I've heard there are over 2,000 hours of recordings. Of course we got gems like this. This song is clearly more inclined to Abnishak than Kira, but still it's such a trance. 
Maybe that's why I thought it was a good idea to put it after you and who's army. It really, really fits that vibe we find from Pyramid Song onwards. Those Thumb York signature lyrics and performance, plus those instruments, those textures, that ambience, I, I don't know. When they release something like this, besides that didn't make it into the record, I can't understand why they do it. Like what it happens with OK Computer back in 2017. Those besides I promise, Man of War Lift, those sound like besides and probably were conceived as besides. But with this song, although I cannot see it fitting in Kid A, Amnesia is a whole other story. And I'm not saying it should replace any song from that record, I'm just saying it does fit in the track list. Which leads me to believe this will be hopefully one of many songs they will release from that era in the anniversary edition. And I'm so eager to listening to those tapes. It's something that among the Radiohead community, it's a myth. You know there's hundreds if not thousands of hours of material and if this is the quality of what they left out, holy damn. It's just my Radiohead fan side talking, but hey, I am excited about this and I cannot wait to listen to it. But hey, if you enjoy what you see, don't forget to give it a like. I'll be uploading more album and song reactions more often, so also don't forget to subscribe. Next week we'll have another song reaction and an album reaction for a band I already reacted to, but this year they released a new record that I couldn't miss a chance to react on camera. So I'll see you then. My name is Tony Whitburn. Thank you so much for watching.